Neela to side, 32 weeks pregnant and contracting. Got it. Let's rotate the chair. Go with the nurse, OK? Let's take them to the break room to get a snack, OK? OK, mama. We're going to take care of your mommy, and then we're going to come and get you, OK? Oh! OK. Let's go ahead, love. Take them to the break room. Right back so the doctor can examine you, OK? There you go. Take this out, please. OK, you're in good hands, love. OK. I can't have this baby. It's not due for another two months. Page OB. BP 142 over 90. That's high. Probably due to anxiety or the pain. Just to be safe, I'm going to order some labs, OK? I'm gonna feel a little pressure. She's bleeding from the cervix. Grab six grand mag bolus and call OB. Tell them we're coming up. Wait, what's going on? Mr. Desai, you may be experiencing an abruption. Your placenta is separating from the wall of your uterus. The overall picture suggests something called preeclampsia with health syndrome. What, what does that mean? It means we need to deliver this baby now. No, 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 no. I know 32 weeks is more premature than we like, but right now your baby's safer outside of your body than inside. I can't deliver this baby premature. This is not my baby. I'm a surrogate. I'm carrying this baby for someone else. I need to carry it to term or I don't get paid. If we don't deliver now, this condition could be fatal for both you and the yeah, baby. I need the money. Miss Desai. No! No! We just got out of the shelter. Okay? I'm not putting my boys through another Chicago winter in one, so please help me. We, we'd like to understand the, the arrangement your clients have with our patient. Well, she has graciously allowed our client's baby to develop in her womb. In turn, they give her a living stipend for every week she nurtures that child. She specifically says she needs the payout. What's that? In the spirit of inspiring a healthy baby, our clients have promised a bonus should Miss Desai carry to term. That's what she's killing herself for. Miss Allen, this contract seems to be incentivizing our patient to put her health at risk. Is there any way to alter this? How so? Well, perhaps she would deliver the baby now if she knew she was still eligible for at least a part of that bonus. Unfortunately, our clients have stipulated that they do not wish to adopt a premature baby. It's their baby. According to the law, my clients are under no obligation to adopt this child. Wait, <laughs> then who's responsible for this baby? If the bio parents choose not to adopt, Ms. Desai is welcome to keep the child or surrender it to the state. Welcome to keep it. Ms. Allen, this contract seems to protect everyone but Ms. Desai and that baby. I'm sorry. That is the arrangement she willingly agreed to. If you have any further questions, please feel free to call my office. Nat. Yeah? I could use your help with the patient. What is it? I can't get through to her. I thought maybe you could talk to her as a mother. Dr. Choi. Ms. Desai, we can't delay this delivery any longer. No, please. Ms. Desai, I'm Dr. Manning. I'm sorry you're going through such a rough time right now. I know when my water broke, I, I was a mess. I wasn't ready to deliver either. I told Dr. Choi, I can't have this baby now. My boys are counting on me to keep a roof over their heads. I understand. I have a son. I would do anything for him. But do you understand what's happening in your body right now? The proteins from your placenta are poisoning your blood. And at any moment, you could have an eclamptic seizure <gasps> that could kill you and this baby. Mr. Sai. Your boys would rather spend a hundred Chicago winters in a shelter than a lifetime without their mother. Don't orphan them for this money. Neela, look at me. Look at me, Neela. Dr. Choi is gonna take you up to OB and you are going to deliver this baby for your boys. <laughs> Okay. Call OB, tell them we're on our way. <laughs> Any issues? She was born shy of four pounds and her lungs are underdeveloped, but I think two months in the NICU will plump her up and get her breathing properly. That's good to hear. 
I'm sorry, but I have some unfortunate news. Our clients have pulled out. What? They don't feel equipped to deal with the complications that come with a premature baby. This is a healthy baby. She just needs some extra attention. I understand. You know, my heart goes out to Neela, all she's been through. But I'm not giving up. I'm sure we can find an adventurous couple willing to take on that little bundle of joy. And maybe get a little something for Neela, too. Of course, you'll get a fee as well. Need to make a quick call. Excuse me. Is this a happy ending? Dr. Choi, this is as happy as it's going to get.